Hey guys, Justin Bryant here from selfmadesuccess.com. In this video, I'm going to show you nine apps that pay you to take pictures on your phone. So the first one that you might look at if you want to take your photography and whatever photos you have on your phone and try to sell them, then Clash Shot is a really good option and you can basically just get the app for your Android or Apple device and you could see the Clash Shot app on both app stores and you can sell and get your commissions every time your photo is sold. So you can sell each photo multiple times and you can set the price. So some of those some of the apps you have to have like a specific price and you get paid that certain price per download, but this one you actually get to set the price and you also build a profile where you can follow and have followers and you get to see your offers all in one place. You can see here you have your messages and offers under your notifications area. And then it'll tell you your total earned money. You can invite other friends and stuff like that. So it covers a lot of different things. It's got about a four star rating out of five on Android and about a three star out of five on Apple. Another one is MyPick, and MyPick is a really cool app because it's kind of a blend of selling photos versus creating uh, art or creating t-shirts or something. So it's kind of like, like if you combine something like Teespring and like a Clash Shot into the same app, that's pretty much what MyPick is. It's only available for Apple right now, but it has a very good rating, 4.5 out of 5 stars, and you can upload your pictures and turn them into phone cases, t-shirts, prints that you can put on your wall, sell them straight up, however you want to do it. So all that stuff is optional within my pick. Another one is 2020. This one is also available just for an, for uh, iPhones right now, but it also allows you to sell your photos and it lets you create a gallery of those photos and you get paid like 20% for each time they download that and they are the ones that set the price. So you do not get to set your price where like Clash Shot or something, you can set all the way up to like $80 per download. Um, 2020 doesn't let you do that, but you can still make pretty good money. Um, just, you know, you want to just take these photos and put them on as many of these as possible so that you can maximize your earnings. But um, they do have a minimum price of $10. And again, this is only for Apple devices right now, but it does have a pretty good rating with 3.8 out of 5 stars. Another one that's available for both Android and iPhones is IM, and they are one of the highest rated on the list at 4.8 out of 5 stars. You can see the Android version here as well. 216,000 plus reviews, over 4 stars. So they pay you um, and you just upload your photos. It's kind of like an Instagram in a way where you can follow people, but you also get to sell photos and market them as well. Uh, they sell the photos via a partnership with Getty Images. So if you've ever heard of, if you've ever looked into photography, you'll know that Getty Images is one of the top, top like stock photo sites out there. So they should be able to get you quite a bit of traffic and, uh, probably more sales than a lot of other ones would as far as the apps go. So you also have other types of apps that aren't necessarily photography, but they have ways for you to make money just taking a picture of receipts, signs, other stuff. So I'm going to mention a few of those. There's, there's tons of them out there, but uh, some of the top rated ones would be like Ibotta, where it's available for both Android and Apple devices. It's all in the editor's choice list on Android, as you can see here. And it's one of the top shopping apps because it pays you to just take pictures of your grocery receipts, your receipts from uh, 
booking hotels at like hotel.com. Um, you have Etsy, you have Groupon, eBay, you have a lot of different choices on here. And they'll pay you via PayPal, via gift cards, in different ways when you cash out. So very versatile as far as just you take pictures and you have a lot of ways to cash out. You have a lot of different items that you can get money back from, from a lot of different industries. So I bought as a really good one. They also have an affiliate program or like a referral program where um, if you get people to try the app, whether they're friends, family, etc., then you get a little bit of what they make as well. Another one very similar to Ibotta is Receipt Hog, which is also available for both Apple and Android devices. They have a 4.7 out of 5 star rating on iPhone. Almost the same thing on Android and basically it is another one. You take pictures of your receipt before you throw it away and they'll give you money back from sites like Kroger, Walmart, uh, Best Buy, Trader Joe's, stuff like that. They also have slots, which is something that Ibotta doesn't have, where it gets you extra points for just like clicking a button every once in a while. But they do not have an affiliate or referral program, so just keep that in mind if you were planning on, you know, marketing this app or referring to other people. It doesn't matter how they sign up because there is no referral program. And last but not least, with these types of apps, you have Checkout 51. And this is another one that's available available for both Android and Apple devices where you take pictures of your receipts and the app pretty much does the rest and pays you for it. Also very highly rated. Does include major stores like Kroger and Walmart and stuff like that, Target, major retailers like that. And Literally, this is what it looks like. You just take the, you have a smartphone, you get the app, you take the picture with your camera on your smartphone from within the app, and then you can throw your receipt away. You're pretty much done with it. And it'll tell you how much you claim every time you do that, depending on certain purchases. So my recommendation to people is to get as many of these as you can because the apps are free and because you can cover a lot more items if you have all of these like three main apps at least so pretty much everybody grocery shops and this is a great way to get money back for that as well as retail as well as uh, your local convenience stores and stuff like that another thing you can do is take pictures of these these signs that say like they're now hiring and it's actually a, an app that's partnered with Indeed.com, which is one of the top jobs websites. And they pay you for taking a photo of the sign and the storefront of the business that has the sign up. So if they see like a help, if you see like a help wanted sign anywhere, you can take a picture of that, take a picture of the name of the store or business and then you can cash out via Amazon gift cards and probably a few other ways now not just Amazon but mostly that's what a lot of people will do is just Amazon gift cards so they have a really good rating 4500 so far have rated this on Android it's also available for iPhone as well if you want to get it there and they both have around a 4.3 out of 5 star rating. Again, Indeed.com backs this app. So it's from a very good source. And you can earn up to like, a, I think it's like a dollar per photo or something like that. Uh, most of the time you might not get that full dollar, but you can get around that area of uh, price per photo. And last but not least, you have FOPE. And FOP is one of my favorite ones out of these because it pays you $5 every time somebody downloads your app. It's very highly rated, very easy to sign up. You can do it all within the app. But it also tells you what has sold recently. So it's really nice to see what is selling right now. You might be able to like find a pattern of what's selling right now. Maybe it's a lot of stuff that has to do with a certain holiday a certain event going on, maybe it's scenery, maybe it's 
has to do with the, the season, whatever. There's a lot of different things that can make photos more likely to sell. Like for instance, if it's Valentine's Day, like the example here, if it's Valentine's Day, a lot of Valentine's Day photos will be sold around that time. And again, you get $5 every time they download it. Plus it has like an Instagram type feature where you can follow people and they can follow you back and you have uh, your profile picture and albums and you have like a description of what you're doing there and those types of things. You also have like a news feed. So those types of things and you can also get it for Apple devices as well. It's available for both Android and Apple. 4.5 stars out of 5 on Apple and a very good uh, 3.8 out of 5 stars on Android. So I hope this video was helpful and I'll see you in the next one.